This is my buddy Daniel, and this is gonna hurt. It's time for the cattle to come home off the desert. In the last video, we gathered the majority of the cattle, but there's still a few on the run. Our goal for today is to gather the remaining cattle without breaking anybody or anything. Don't get that truck in. Oof, that's the end of my line, boys. We started the morning by expanding our search from the previous days. Yeah, we do this. Let's go! Let's go! We found all the missing cattle that morning, except for two cows and their calves. They got away from us, and they're not going to be easy to corral. So we came up with a plan to catch them. So pretty much what we've done, there's five or six riders, and we're all spread out in a straight line right here, and we're going to head towards the fence. And if we find them, we're gonna push them towards this fence and then across the road, and we're gonna go corral them on the other side of the corrals. Now, there's a reason these few are still out here. These few cows are still out here because they're freaking, wait for them or go ahead. Oh, they're a pain in the butt. They're really good at running away and I'll hiding. Go ahead. We haven't found nothing yet. We've been walking for a couple minutes now. This stuff in here, it's just so crazy thick. The cows don't even need to be running that fast. They just need to be smart about where they're running. They can weave under trees. And then what these few cows have been doing is they've been circling back on us. So it's hard to predict where they're gonna hide at. And once they know you can't see them, they'll hide under a tree. So I'm kind of looking for legs. Sometimes you can see calves pretty easy. Something's been munching on that cactus. We just found this little red cow. Where's your calf? Oh, it's laying down right here. I think we better just hold it for a minute. Yeah, I think we can just take I'll back off a little bit. Wondering what we should do. You think she'll stay with her calf? We don't really know what to do about this. <laughs> We're gonna wait for the other guys to get here. This is where things get a little confusing. So let me explain. We found both of the cows at the same time. Byron and I found the red pair and Kirk and Dan found the black pair. So we were split into two groups. Let's start with the red cow first. So I forgot to hit record, but we've chased this cow all the way through the cedars. Now we're up on the hillside. Those guys are down on the road. Maybe we go meet up with them now. Hey, turn around. Hey. Hey. Can you bring that cow up here to us? Right. We're working on it. Get ahead of them! Get ahead of them! Hey! Hey, cow! Hey! Hey! If I can get a rope on her, I kind of want to. I'll follow her this way. Psycho freaking crazy sucker. Hey! How's it going, Daniel? Are you going to make it up here? Yeah, with the three of us, we'll get it. We got her where we can see her pretty good now. Make noise on Hey! Let go. Freaking cow. After Byron roped the cow, her calf took off into the cedars. So I chased after it with my rope. All right, this calf's getting away from us. Bye, Joe's got her mom roped.
Oh, it's harder to open this. Remember that black cow Kirk and Dan found? Well, Kirk had it next to the corral by the time I caught the calf. But she's not in the corral yet, so we'll come back to her later. Get ahead! Get ahead! Get ahead! Gate open here on the left side. Ah! I had to chase this a little calf a long ways through the trees. Oh, uh, Byron has the mom. It was the pair we were chasing. While I put the calf in the corral, her mom was giving Byron a hard time. Don't lose that sucker. Hi. Hey. That's the end of my line, boys. That was a little wild. That was fun, though. Slow down, you psycho. Hey, I'm gonna need this help with this cow. Set, I'm gonna need some help with this cow. She got the rope away from me. We're gonna take this cow and put her in the dang corral. She can't get a rope. I'll haze her to you. Smart here. We don't want it on the other side of the hill. Okay, rebuild. Sneak up right there behind her if you can. I just don't want to run over the hill or into the cedars. Tyler brought that other calf. Now she's on the east side. So sweet. Yeah, we'll Tyler did get that other calf. Did Tyler get that little red calf? Affirmative, yes. Well, good. Do you want us to bring a trailer down the road or what? No, I lost my rope. She's coming towards the trail on the corral on this hill. Have him bring the dogs. And bring the dogs. She'll be good. She's moving again. Where's she at? Right here, right here. 
Here you go. Don't get that truck. Don't get that truck. You <laughs> sucker. Yeah, you psychopath. Get in the grill. Open the gate. We'll let her in the main grill. Push her out that way and I'll pull her in. Heads up. After we put the red cow in the corral, nice job. <laughs> it was time to deal with the black cow. Kirk had got her into a large wire pen, but she wasn't in the corral yet. She try and get away again? Is that why you guys roped her? We got her out here by the trail. When she gets claustrophobic, she wanted to run off. Go to the hole. Get up out, out here where oh, you can rope her. Oh. Let me rope her. Why can't you. why can't you just be patient? Because I'm just no, I'm having more fun than you are. <laughs> I'm not impatient, I just roped her. You didn't. Here, let me get this off real quick. Hey, wait right there. Hey, ow. <laughs> Sorry, bud. You okay, Daniel? I'm good. Yeah. Look out, cat. Uh, that was not graceful. Come here, baby. The dogs are in the water trough. Albert, <laughs> leave her alone. <laughs> At the end of the day, we got the job done and corralled both of the troublemakers. But this won't be the last time we deal with the black cow. Oh, she's a waspy one, boys. Make sure you subscribe because the next video is gonna be wild.